The ultra rare Dracula parrot looks like a vampire and screams to communicate. This vulture parrot hybrid is found only within the jungles of Papua New Guinea and might be the most gothic bird on earth. Its scarlet red belly is surrounded by a sleek black plumage and grey scaling, like a cape. Its vulture-like hooked beak protrudes from its small bald head set with beady eyes. It lives a nomadic life, feeding on a highly specialized diet. Though it may not be as bloodthirsty as its name implies, the Dracula parrot is nonetheless an eerie sight. Formerly called Pesces Paradorsifrichus fulgidus, this sinister-looking bird is the only member of its genus and its genus is the only member of its subfamily. It's truly one of a kind, and the resemblance it bears to Dracula is somewhat uncanny. These ominous looking birds are only native to the mountainous rainforests of the island of New Guinea and the wider geographical Pacific area known as Oceania. Outside of this, there are only a few zoos worldwide that house the creepy vulturine parrot. Besides its resemblance, that's about all the Dracula parrot has in common with vultures. This parrot feasts mainly on a sticky species of hard to find figs, the rarity of which endangers its survival. However, nectar and certain flowers have also been known to frequent the diet of these frugivores. Like vultures, the Dracula parrot has evolved to lose the feathers on its head so that it doesn't get messy with the sticky syrup of figs. Dracula parrots appear to be somewhat social and are typically spotted in pairs or sometimes large groups of up to 20. Dracula parrots are fairly large, clocking in at 18 inches long and weighing between 24 and 28 ounces. There is very little difference between male and female Dracula parrots. One telltale mark is that most males have a red spot on their heads behind their eyes. Despite its name, the Dracula parrot is the hunted and not the hunter. Its swings are highly prized in certain indigenous markets and its chicks command very high prices too. Not much is known about the Dracula parrot's breeding habits in the wild. Researchers have gleaned that females lay up to two eggs at a time in a nest inside a big hollow tree. Fuzu has successfully bred a Pesquet's parrots. These births also marks a rare achievement for zoos all around the world. The chicks requires hand feeding by keepers around the clock, about every 5 hours. The Pesquets parrots, also known as the Dracula parrot, diet consists mostly of fruit. This is actually the reason their heads are mostly featherless, and thus they can avoid getting their feathers covered in sticky fruit juices.